to hospital when he was just six weeks old and subsequently lost both his legs and the hearing in his right ear. After being inspired by Captain Sir Tom Moore, Tony took on a 10-kilometre challenge and raised nearly 1.7... This is a child raising £1.7 million pounds mm. for the Evelina Children's Hospital that looked after him. Tony, his sister Lacey and his parents, Paula and Mark, join us now. Uh, welcome to all of you. It's so lovely to see you all there together um, at home as a family. Um, tell us, first of all, just tell us a little bit, um, Tony, about what it was like to, uh, to meet Kate. Um, it was like... Was it really exciting? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I bet it was. I bet it was. I bet it was, it, it was exciting. It was We're looking at pictures strong. of you <laughs> doing just that, looking incredibly smart, Tony, uh, and very, very royal at Westminster Abbey. Mm. Um, what did she say to you? Can you remember? I don't know if Mum and Dad can yeah. remember, yeah. can you? <laughs> 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 um, yeah, she, she was absolutely lovely, spent ages talking to Tony, asked him lots of questions. Uh, obviously, she knew all about him um, and she asked him what his favourite uh, Christmas carol was or song. Um, what yeah. did you reply, Tony? Um, Santa Baby. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, now, I'll tell well... you what, I mean, we've heard... <laughs> that you might have a favourite Christmas song. And we know, Tony, that you've had a tough start in life. Mm. You've got a lovely family around you now, thank goodness. Um, and, but you are, you are, we use the word a lot, but you are inspirational at how you you've are. overcome that start, I mean, hasn't it, he, and all the family around him. I think so, and just, I mean, just to sort of explain a little bit that, that you know, um, Tony's birth parents basically allowed him to become very poorly, didn't they? And, they and that did. was why he, he was did. in hospital and lost his legs and has been adopted by, um, by this family. And, and Paula, just, it must be, I, I'm so moved by his own determination mm. that, that he has raised 1.7 million pounds for that hospital and and i think that is something else that's going to define the rest of his life that that he that was spirit. able that spirit mm. paula and that he was able to do that it's a it's a magnificent thing to witness yeah absolutely i mean he inspires us all every day um he never gives up he just keeps going um and you know he, he just wants to help so many people as well he's a very caring loving little boy um who just yeah he's just like a little shining star really um, and you are... he, he, he he like i say he never gives up <laughs> well, you're all wonderful um, to create the family around. And sister too, and sister too. Uh, it's a lovely to meet <laughs> all of you. And as you said, you do have a favourite Christmas song. Remind us of what it is, Tony, if you can. Um, what is it? What is it? Go on, say it. <laughs> he was like this with uh, with Kate, and um, <laughs> he just said, Santa baby. Santa and baby. And then William said, oh, I like that one too. Oh, did he? Good. <laughs> well, I think we've got a chance for you to have a little burst of it, haven't we? Yes, we have. Come on, let's hear from our group, The Music Project, which have been Music Man Project and been entertaining us all morning. And this is Give for you, Tony. Give us a Tony. burst of Santa baby. as well with a good song <laughs> well, listen, um lovely to meet all of you have a wonderful christmas yep. all together all the best lacy paula mark and, and of course and all of you oh thank oh, you thank so you much. much please we just hope you have an absolutely magical christmas you are clearly just fabulous people and it was uh, lovely to see you all today thank you